The tenure elongation of the John Adige Oi gun led executive and other party officials has reportedly caused division among governors elected on the platform of the All Progressives Congress, APC. Premium Times reports that Governors Nazar El Rufai of Kadena and Simon Laulong of Plateau simply said they, governors, have agreed not to speak to the media. The news outlet, however, quoting an unnamed source, reported that the governors had a heated debate over the tenure elongation of party officials. I am not sure what happened inside the chamber could be called a real meeting. They were simply fighting, the source, who declined to be named because he is not authorized to speak to the media said. Meanwhile, the news agency of Nigeria, NAN, reports that state governors of APC who met behind closed doors with President Muhammadu Buhari at the presidential villa, Abuja, on Tuesday, declined comments on the outcome of the meeting. NAND however, reports that its correspondent overheard one of the governors saying that they were directed not to speak with journalists over issues discussed at the meeting. It gathered that the meeting could not reach consensus on some of the issues discussed including the challenges facing the APC national executives over tenure elongation. The governors who appeared divided over the issue of tenure elongation for the APC national executives, had met briefly among themselves before the arrival of President Buhari for the meeting. President Buhari had at the APC National Executive Committee NEC, meeting on March 27, said the tenure elongation of the party's executives was illegal and unconstitutional. The APC national chairman, John Adaiji Oigun had earlier inaugurated a committee to advise the party on the way forward following President Buhari's recent opposition to the tenure extension. The NEC had extended by a year, the tenure of Adaiji Oigun led executives and others across all levels of the party starting from June. The president said the decision was unconstitutional and already causing acrimony within the party. He said, in particular, I think it is important for me to speak quickly on the contentious issue of the tenure of our national and state executive officers. As we all know, a motion was moved at the last National Executive Committee meeting of February 27, 2018, to the effect that when the tenure of the current executives expire in June this year, they should be allowed to continue for one year. This motion was duly carried by a majority of members present at the last NEC meeting, even though some of our party members have since spoken up very vehemently against it. Others have even taken the matter to court. On my own part, I have taken some time to review and seek advice on the resolution. And what I found is that it contravenes both our party constitution and the constitution of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. Apostrophe. Nan also learnt that the meeting between the APC governors and the president would be reconvened next week at the same venue. Governors at the meeting include Yahayu Bello, Kogi, Jubril Abindo, Adamawa, Budaru Abubakar, Jigawa, Rolf Eric Zola, Osam, Atiku Begadu, Kebi, Rotimi Akuradilu, Ondo, Abdifata Ahmed, Kwara. Also in attendance are Godwin Obasaki, Edo, Abdullahi Gonduj, Kano, Tanko Almakura, Nasarawa, Kashishetama, Borno, Rakaza Koroka, Aimo, Akinwan Miambode, Lagos, Abiola Ojimabi, Oyo, Abubakar Bello, Niger. The rest include Dominu Tambuel, Sokoto, Abdulaziz Yari, Zamfara. Simon Lalog, Plateau, Samuel or Tom, Benyu, Nazar El Rufai, Kadena, and Ibaikun Lamosam, Ogun. 
Katsina State Governor Aminu Masari and Ibrahim Dam of Yobi were absent at the meeting while Governor Abdullahi Abubakar of Baki State was represented by his deputy. We had earlier reported that state governors in Nigeria on the platform of the ruling All Progressives Congress APC, are reportedly meeting with President Muhammadu Buhari and Said also Rock reportedly in their bid to pressure the him to seek re-election in 2019.